Revealed an unexpected turn of events. Three years from now, you'll discover an android created by a scientist named Dr. Giraud. And in one year, you, Goku, will die from a heart virus. But I can help you. As hard as it is to believe, this young boy named Trunk is the son of Bulma and Vegeta. And he has traveled back in time no! from the future. Before returning back to his own time, Trunks gave Goku some very potent heart medicine. It has now been three years since that day. A new threat. Goku. You know you don't stand a chance against us. We've been watching you. We've seen all of your battles with our spy robots. Oh, really? Did you make sure to watch all of my battles on Planet Namek? There was no need. We learned all we needed to learn from your scuffles with Vegeta. You revealed all of your powers and techniques. Maybe, but you've overlooked a very important detail. I'm stronger than you think. Looks like you've managed to power up quite a bit, haven't you? But... I can beat you at this level. And I know that 19 can take you with his eyes closed. Alright! Why don't you both get over here? And we'll see how strong you really are!
Say in Vegeta. You know, I can tell by watching your moves. You guys aren't the great fighters I heard you were. Forgetting what we already know, aren't you? We submitted all your moves to memory. My powers cannot be measured by such simple observations. Oh, 
what? I can't believe it! He's become a super saiyan! The one thing I've always wanted to be the strongest fighter in the universe. I suck the most grueling training. I realize my limit as a fighter. The anger of myself. Swelled up inside of me. And woke my Super Saiyan powers! I think that's enough to chat for now. Nineteen. I'll fight some with you. Get him out of our way. Retreated to his laboratory in order to activate his reinforcements. No way. Ah, oh, they're gone. But... Where? I was here, ready to fight them. And they ignored me. I'll 
show them! When you do morons think you're running off to... We're going to Goku's house to kill him. You'll have a hard time getting past me. When I'm done with you, you'll be nothing but lawnmower parts. Those sayings and their blind overconfidence. Pride will always be their greatest handicap. Bad. Why don't you put a cork in that big mouth of yours? I'll prove that you're wrong! My turn. I'll do it. Oh! <laughs> 